All right, here we go. We got our, our new MicroGuard filter. Take this sucker out here. Okay, if you don't know what type of oil filter is the right one for your vehicle, just go ahead and ask your, your local shop there. You can also look it up online. Pretty much any of these websites, you can you can look them up just by your vehicle, make, model, and year, and you can find it. So um, this one actually has a nice little seal on it. That's not very common, which is pretty cool. Seeing how this is like the lowest cost one they have. Okay, I'm gonna remove that. Next thing I wanna do, you see this gasket here? It runs around it, that black gasket, that rubber gasket. I'm gonna put some oil on that and I'm gonna use some of this new oil, okay? No, a great way to do that. Just gonna pop this top here. This is a real pain in the butt doing this with one hand, I tell you what. Okay, oh, of course you got a seal on it. Well, good on them, but it's kind of a pain in the butt. There's no lip. Ah, how do you get this thing out of here? Oh, just pop it with your thumb. Like a tough guy. Okay, I'm just gonna get some of this new oil on my glove, okay? And just kind of spread it around that gasket. That's gonna help it create a nice tight seal, okay? I'm gonna wipe off my oil off my finger so I, it's not all greased up so I can actually put this thing back on okay now we're gonna go over get under there this thing only needs to be hand tightened okay right there just make sure you don't have any nasty stuff up there uh, in fact it's usually a good idea to wipe it off a little bit some of that old oil. So I'm gonna go get a clean paper towel. You can also use a rag or anything like that. Just make sure it's clean. You don't wanna be trying to clean it off with something that's dirty, right? So, okay. And it's also, you just gotta be careful you don't get a bunch of lint or anything like that in there kind of particles okay take my new filter this is hella weird trying to do this with a camera okay so get it hand tightened and then do another quarter turn till it's nice and snug okay that looks good okay now I've got my drain plug okay and I wipe that sucker down has a nice gasket on it make sure you put a new gasket on it if it needs it okay find the threads where am I at where am I at here there we go I found it that's a weird sound do is I'm going to take my socket there which I don't want to grab it with my uh, my greasy hand so um, I'm going to tighten that up okay you don't want to over tighten it um, but tighten it up and to where it naturally stops and then just give it a little tiny bit of a little little, little extra something something tighten it final tighten and then we're going to start filling this baby back up stay tuned